Well, we didn't uh, end up going four-wheeling today, so we we're planning on doing that tomorrow since it's going to be a nice day tomorrow anyway. Uh, ran into my sister and our friend Jamie, so we kind of had our day a little bit occupied today. Uh, we're going to go on a little mushroom hunt down the trail. Don't know if we'll find anything, but maybe, just maybe, we'll have some mushrooms with our steak. And I have a Caesar salad here, so that's what we're going to try out right now. Right one? That's not the right one. Is it? I have no idea what that one is. So there's gills. It's not sweet tooth, is it? No, it's really. Look at the gills on that. Oh, it's different, right? The other ones, they come down. I like have no spots. idea what that one is. Okay, so listen, I'm no expert here, but when I when I use this book here, that looks like a red hot milky. Is what it's called here. And the edibility, edibility scale is possibly poisonous. Oh. So we're gonna leave that one behind. Yeah, we'll leave that there. <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks. Eh? Boy, slim pickings. I don't see anything that stands out here for you. No. I think it was in there that we seen them the last time. Nothing there. Pushing the end of the season here now. Yeah. It's hard to see too because the leaves camouflage a lot of different things, right? Yeah, if we were to go around and kick up the leaves, maybe we would see more, but we didn't find any obvious mushrooms yet. Probably won't at the end of the season. It'd be nice to have a little bit with our supper. There's lots on the tree here, but I know they're not in. Are. They look all dried up. <clears throat> Nothing. Ow. Nothing, eh? Northern Ontario? Like, if you didn't, like, store your food by now, you'd be... Starving. <laughs> <laughs> you might get some rabbits or some Did bush you see chickens. A rabbit? No, I saw a bush chicken though earlier. Well, he was he was down the. There trail. ain't a whole lot of options. No. No. Just prepping up the steaks for the barbecue. Coals. Steaks are ready to go on the barbecue. Three minutes to twist. Three minutes to twist. Oh no. What is this? Is that? 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 Is 
salad, which is an easy job mm -hmm. in my books. Oh my, hey, you bear. Am I making the salad? You heard the word salad, which means vegetables. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Why, Why do you need to hurt that right across? Why did they put so much tape? Look at this, people. Here, open, open the top there for a second. You want to see something really weird? Watch this. Water tuber. <coughs> oh yeah. <laughs> A dog that likes salad. <laughs> he loves veggies. <laughs> Good boy. One more? You can have that one. Yeah. Mr. Shark Face. Alright, so we're going to throw in all of this except for whatever this is. Is that parsley? I don't know. But it's not going in my Caesar salad. We're gonna throw in, there's bacon bits, cheese, and croutons. No, once this is in there, you can't have any chew bear. Jen doesn't <laughs> like parsley. <laughs> I do. Just is it on? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Bam! You see people see that? Ooh. <laughs> yeah, Bam! <laughs> oh. Oh no. <laughs> he also made me put the lemon on my steak. I mean, on my. What do you call this? Salad. Oh my god, people. Hey. <laughs> it's hard to know the woman, oh. eh? You don't like no parsley. <laughs> it's a useless. I don't know what you call it. Bam! It's just there to make shit look pretty. <laughs> I don't get that. <laughs> Look at this. Look at that crust. Look at that medium rare. Oh yeah. Mm. <laughs> Why don't you do a little show and tell? Mine? Yeah. It's a little undercooked. What? Mm-hmm. Undercooked. Yep. It's closer to a medium. Oh my god, a medium. <laughs> oh. It's not a medium, not even no pink in it. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> Getting your goat. We are getting ready to go to the fire tower, hopefully. Do you got your phone so we got uh, directions? Just getting on the four-wheeler now. Dog's in the trailer. And we're getting ready to go for out, out for a couple hour ride. Let's see if we can find that fire tower.
Well, we followed the uh, GPS on Rob's cell phone and we seem to be at the top of the hill. Um, decided to stop and take a little walk around. It's getting hot in the helmets. Um, but we can't seem to see this fire tower. But you would think. Did we? But you think you'd see. It should be over here somewhere. Yeah. Boy, yeah, doesn't it? I mean, you can see it from the dirt road. You think you'd be able to see it from here now. I do apologize. Our gimbal is giving us some issues, so we had to leave it back at the camp because we didn't. I don't know. It's giving us some sort of error. Couldn't figure it out without the internet. So, you guys are on tripod mode for now. <sighs> we are bushwhacking. Probably right on top of that rock over there. Yeah, you think? This is proving to be difficult. <laughs> we made it to the top of this base. You see it? Where? Oh, way over there. <laughs> oh, gosh. Well, this is a topo map of Canada. Yeah. You sure there's not two around here? Well, I mean, I don't know. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's way, way out there in between these two trees in the distance. Oh. Well, we've pushed back back to the four-wheeler and we're going to go a little further and see if we can find it. It's a little bit in the distance, but we'll give it a go, see what happens with this trail. <laughs> this four-wheeling trail has gotten really crazy. <laughs> like, toss you around and there's almost no trail left here. We're not even sure now on the GPS where we are because I don't know why but it seems as though it was mismarked on the map that we have on the GPS and since we don't see this fire tower anymore we don't even know where we're going exactly we were told this trail was really nice and <laughs> and would be a great ride, but it hasn't turned out to be. <laughs> well, this trail goes nowhere, down there about 50 feet or so, and then it just stops completely, dead end. Whew. And we still can't see the fire tower in the distance at all, so not sure if the trail's just really grown right in or at that end or what's going on but holy I don't think we're gonna find it today we might have to take our friends Ray and Tina for a ride next year and uh, give it another go maybe I think we're running out of oh, time today to go to an I don't know if there is even another trail or not. But, oh, I just got a soaker. Yuck! In this lovely swampy water. Oh man. Oh man. Shoot, all my rubber boots. This is where we got turned around the first time. And pretty sure this is the right trail. <laughs> You'd need an Argo. 
It's like a lake in there now, a little swamp. Well, it's hard for me to tell how deep it is. It's very, yeah, it's at, I mean, right here is at least a foot, and then you don't know how, how sludgy it is either, right? But like, it's just, yeah, it's a massive pond. Yeah, we ain't crossing that. camp and grab the dog <laughs> hi my buddy we're gonna finish packing up the truck and head on home I guess say hey? Yeah, that's a fail. <laughs> Another one. <laughs> that fire tower was not in our cards this summer. <laughs> so we successfully made it back to camp. Everything's put away pretty close to fully packed up for the season. This week is supposed to be warm, so we didn't fully uh, put the trailer away. Hopefully, maybe next weekend we'll be out again for another adventure. So. Misadventure. Misadventure? What do you mean? <laughs> and hopefully my gimbal will be working. I think we should call ourselves Pursuit from Misadventure. <laughs> misadventure. Because every time we try, something happens. Yeah. So here we go. We're going to head out. And we will see you guys again next week on the next adventure. Thanks for watching. If you're new here, please subscribe. It really helps us grow our channel and we appreciate everyone watching. Have a great week everyone and we will see you next Sunday for another adventure.